Hello, I'm Daniel, and welcome to the Immuno Project. We here at the Immuno Project are continuing in our series of videos with respect to information, education, inspiration, guidance, and advice. And when I continue in my series of um, stories with respect to the great uh, Hasidic masters, and I want to tell a, a story about Rabbi Yisroel of Rizhin. Rabbi Yisroel, when he was a little boy, um, was once walking up and down in the the courtyard, the yard, and in, in front of the shul, in front of the synagogue on a Friday evening. Um, and it was getting late. All the Hasidim were already in the synagogue. They're already starting. Mincha uh, Marav, Kabbalah Shabbos. Things were starting to get underway. If you've ever been in a, in a Hasidic neighborhood, when you see the men running off uh, to synagogue, that you know they would don't want to be late, people... So one of the guys arriving, he's scurrying by, and he notices little um, Yisroel. He's kind of like, you know, walking around. And he says to him, why don't you go in? Shabbos uh, has already begun. Well, it's time. Let's, let's go. Shabbos is here. And the boy says, it's not Shabbos yet. And the chassid says, and how do you know? The little boy answered, little... Yisroel answered, on Shabbos, on the Sabbath, there always appears a new heaven. And he looks up and he says, I can't see any sign of it yet. It's not Shabbos yet. Sabbath has not yet come. Uh, we're going to be doing uh, other videos along these lines. Please come back. Please watch. Please learn. And until next time, on behalf of the Amuna Project, I'm Daniel, and thank you so much.